So I've made some more of these uh, little water batteries up and now what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to try and power this calculator with it and also this uh, digital alarm clock. I think I may have to uh, hook a couple of them in uh, series and a couple in parallel to increase the voltage and the current. I'm going to go and do that now then. Right, I've got three of these soldered together now. And uh, I've got them coming out on some wires which we can put straight into uh, this breadboard. And then uh, we can uh, test the voltage off that then. And then uh, try and power these two devices. These are two crocodile clips straight to my multimeter. And I'm just going to switch this on to the DC range now and we're getting about 1.6 volts so uh, we've also hooked this up direct to the uh, breadboard and what I'm going to do now is uh, just show you that I've uh, soldered a couple of connections in the back here and if I try and switch it up a second you get nothing and what I'm going to do is hook up one of these to one of the terminals and then the other one to the other one and that doesn't come on so I think we've got it hooked up the wrong polarity so if we swap them around oh it's come on already and just to show you that off on so that's great that's uh, that's definitely running the calculator then, straight off that uh, water battery. Now I'd like to test it out for the uh, the alarm clock to see if we can get the uh, the buzzer to work in it. That's great. 